Hello everyone. In today's video, we'll see real-life applications of stacks in data structure. What is mean by stacks? Stack is a data structure following LIFO order, last in, first out order. Means if here is a stack and this is empty, we can insert the element. When we are inserting element, this is first one element, it is at the bottom of the stack. And when we are inserting more elements, when we are inserting the element inside the stack, this operation is known as push. So, then again push the one more element, it will be on the top of the previous one. And if you want to remove the element, if you want to pop out the element, then you can remove out from only this end means the from only top. So this is last in first out order because 6 is inserted at the end at the last and it removes first. So this stack is following the LIFO order last in first out order. So let's see, see some real life applications of stack where we are using the stacks in real life. First example, woman bangles. Women wear a bangle one by one and to pull out the first one, they have to first pull out the last one. Here is the bangle. When inserting the bangle, this is the first one bangle. Okay, if you want to remove now this one, you need to remove, you need to pull out this bangle first, then only you can access this one. Next example is text editor. We are using the text editor in the form and in this we are using the operation like undo and redo. These are the options for undo and this one is for the redo. Undo is saving this different operation means this is a recent one and before this we did this autocorrect typing and all. Okay, if you want to autocorrect this option, you want to go to this option, first you need to undo this typing, then you can go to this one. Next example is mobile phone. If you want to check the call log, if you want to check the first person call log, you have to scroll down. So, you need to scroll down and at the end, you can check the first person call. Because this will show the recent call. So in this stack, this is a recent call and this one is a first call. Okay, this one is a first call. So you can scroll down and you can check for the first call and you will get the recent data at the top of the stack. Now we will see the one more example. Floors in the building. A person is living on the top floor. If he want to go outside, then he need to come down first. Come on the ground floor, then he can go outside. So, this is a first, see, this is a bottom of the stack. Then, this is a, uh, in this case, we are considering person at the, on the top floor. Okay, then he need to come down here, and then only he can go outside. One more example is browser. We are using the different web browser and if you want to go back on the previous website, you can uh, click on the back arrow or you can go in history and you can check the recent closed sites or you can uh, click on this list. See, for this, suppose you are on this website, here, you can just click on these three dots uh, next to your profile pic. Here is the option history and history. See, this is a history. And here you will get the different options, different website name. This is a stack. This is a recent one. Okay, and if you want to check for the previous, these are the previous websites used by this person. Okay. And one more example is CD-DVD stand. 
if you want to remove the last one series first you need to remove all these series then only you can access this last series so it will follow this lipo order last thing first out now first you need to pop out all these series then only you can access this first one series so these are the different examples of where we are using this stack in real life same concept you can use you can develop by using the data structure for the computing means you can use this for the different purposes thank you if you have any query regarding this video you can type it in a comment box thank you very much